Hi, this is Jessica Hagman, Media Arts and Studies Librarian at The Ohio University Libraries. In this video, I'm going to show you how to get access to articles in the Journal of the Audio Engineering Society. The easiest way to find articles from the AES Journal is to go to the Audio, Audio Engineering Society website, scroll over Publications, and click on the Journal, and then search through Past Issues. Here you're going to enter your search term. I'm going to look for sonifications. Click search. And then look for an article that matches my topic. And what you really want to look for once you decide that you have an article that you're interested in is the volume and issue number and the year because that tells you how you get access to the full text. Right now I don't have access to the full text of this article from 2012. The library has an online subscription to articles from 2012 on via the AES website, but to get access to that you need to go through the library website. So I'm going to go back to the library homepage and use the Alice catalog and do a periodical title search for the Journal of the Audio Engineering Society. Click search. And we have paper copies of this journal for some years and then we have electronic access through from 2012 on. When I click on this link it's going to take me back to the AES website but it's recognized that now I have a subscription to the journal because I'm a member of the university. So this article was from the most recent issue that was November 2012. I could click here and all of the articles from this journal are listed. I could scroll through and find the article on sonifications. If the article is not from 2012 on, you have two options. The easiest one and the one that I would recommend is to go to My Accounts from the library homepage, click on Interlibrary Loans or Iliad, and then log in with your Ohio ID and password. I've already logged into the accounts, so that's why it comes up for me. And then you're going to click to request an article and then fill in the information about the article. So they need the journal article, the article title, the year and page numbers for sure, um, but there's also lines for other information that you may have. And you could just copy and paste this directly from your search results. So I would copy in the title of the article, uh, the author, and all that information. And the staff who work at Interlibrary Loan, what they're going to do is go see if we have a paper copy or if another library has a paper copy and scan it and make it available to you. They'll send you an email, you'll come back to this website and log in, and then it will be listed under electronically received articles. You can see I have a couple of articles listed here that I have already requested. Clicking on the view will get you the PDF of the article. In the event that you did need a paper copy of the article right away and it was something that we have, you can get access to those in the library or have them sent to the library from the annex. So from 1987 to 2003 is on the seventh floor of the library at this call number right here. Or from 1973 to 1986 is at the annex. And in that case, you would click on request annex or intercampus and that takes um, that same day or next day they'll have that item sent from the annex to the library. Interlibrary loans time frame is one to two business days so that's Monday through Friday. So that depends on what um, time frame you're working on and how old the article is. I hope this video showed you how to get articles out of the Journal of the Audio Engineering Society. If you have any questions about finding articles in this journal or finding any other information, my contact information is here. Just feel free to let me know how I can help.